so basically we have already covered the at how we can add users into another group so now we will uh, also like do some other operation like for this we will i will uh, just create another user uh, i will use the command add user using sudo and i will give it the name as a file name let's create uh, create with a high command uh, sorry yeah new password high command high command i think yeah I have written correct. I will not provide any kind of extra information. Just uh, yes, okay, done. So to check whether the user has been created or not, what we do? We check the this file that is hackerman has been created here. You can see the with UID one double zero eight and GID one double zero eight. Okay. So uh, for login, so how you can do it? You can just switch uh, user su hacker man and the password hacker man so as you can see we are in this the hacker man directory okay so when you do ls so nothing you don't have permission ls okay here you can see all those kind of things log out i will use exit okay exit we use it for uh, like uh, close that particular session of that particular user so now what we can do we will just uh, try to uh, change the username of that uh, not username uh, i will add first some kind of comments in that particular user so how you can do it user mod hyphen c so here i will use a hyphen c option okay to provide some comments so let me provide like uh, i am a hacker okay and the uh, name of that uh, particular user hack command and i will use sudo like uh, because we can't use normally this command okay so now let's uh, check the sorry not i don't want to switch i need this one yeah so here you can see the comment has been added like i am a hacker so in this way uh, if you want to like uh, uh, add some kind of comments like in our previous video you can see like uh, there is a developer section and if you want to add some comment to that particular user then you can add like uh, this is first developer this is second developer or his id is this his id is this okay and kind of this kind of things you can do okay so now moving forward what we can do uh, we can also change the uid what is uid uid is just the unique identifier number uh, which you can change of any particular user which you want so how you can do it simple just provide a uh, hyphen which option u option and then uid which you want so right now what it is 1008 i will give it as 2008 let's hit enter and again uh, let's check this content of that particular file and it should be change uh, yeah so here you can see 2008 this is the uid and what is this 1008 this is the gid okay but we have what change we have changed the uid okay so uh, we have covered now hyphen c hyphen u now moving forward and uh, if you want to change the username of this particular hacker man like from a hacker man to if you want to change it to like um, best hacker like this like this kind of thing if you want to so how you can do it uh, i will use again the sudo user mod okay and i will use hyphen l option for changing the username hyphen l and the new username which you want i want uh, sorry uh, i want uh, best hacker okay i will hit enter and uh, again check here so here you can see the name from hacker man to best hacker like it has been changed so in this way you can also change the uh, like username of your uh, okay you can change the username of your particular user if you want okay and also you the most uh, like important thing is here you can use hyphen e option also okay uh, hyphen e option what it will provide it will just add the like expiry date like when that user should be get disabled so you can do it using the just one option that is a user mod hyphen e e stands for expiry and the particular date on which you want okay so today is uh, 28 i will provide it as a 30 okay 30 no not in this i think year month and then 2022 
and then month that is 8 and 30 okay I will hit enter and the hacker man doesn't exist yeah because we have changed the name from hacker man to which best hacker best hacker done let's check whether it is reflecting or not it should okay but here it is not reflecting it reflects in the I think shadow file okay so uh, in this way you can also add the expiry date uh, and uh, one more uh, like important command is that locking and unlocking of user account how you can do it in this so for this option we use the capital L option okay to lock a user so in this what happens like uh, the, that user can't log in using the username and password like but other methods are required like key based or switching user like which uh, we did here earlier okay so to log the user what we can do user mod hyphen l uh, capital n and the best hacker permission denied why we have not used sudo hit enter we have logged the user if I will try to not right now uh, first of all I have to delete some users uh, uh, like I am Linux marketing these all the users I want to delete uh, how you can do it sudo user del uh, I am Linux marketing maybe I uh, simultaneously if I um, I don't know I can do or not mt1 tester2 tester1 developer 1 developer 2 okay but I don't think I am succeed or not I don't think okay so no I am not uh, like able to like uh, delete that users like simultaneously okay so I will need to do one by one let me do it first because uh, I have to just show you like uh, I, can, I am not able to log in using the username and password okay sudo user del developer1 again developer developer2 again tester1 tester2 marketing what is the name of the user that mt1 done again it is marketing something marketing2 done I am Linux I am Linux done okay so we have uh, deleted all the users like extra users which we had created earlier okay so now let me check the again that file okay so here you can see on the best hacker is there so now what I will do I will try to like uh, uh, switch user from here okay uh, wait a minute it's uh, like yeah not listed it's not uh, showing yeah here it is not showing okay so when we will unlock then we will try to check whether it is uh, like visible or not that option of particular that user okay so I think if we have logged it that's why it's not uh, visible to us okay so uh, now to unlock the particular user what you can do you can you have to just use hyphen u option okay but before that I will show you this one like if you are able to switch or not Uh, I don't think we are authentication failure okay okay authentication failure will be there yeah I'm correct so now what if we have blocked the user now what we can do we will provide this hyphen u option it will unlock the user okay so again let's check whether we are able to log in or not so now now we are able to log in so when you will log the user you can't just uh, mm, log in or anything for like using username and password okay so here also if we try to check uh, whether the name of that particular user is available or not switch user 
just wait for a minute like it takes some time so here you can see i am a hacker why it's showing because we have added that comment okay so where it is showing okay but uh, i am still logging into my account oh i have added wrong done okay so uh, that's all for this video guys i hope you learned about like how you can uh, edit the username add comments uh, like editing username like mostly we want to edit okay and uh, most and we will not use a hyphen l option like uh, we, we don't want to lock anyone okay so uh, you can do it or uh, if you have guys any problem with this particular video or our previous video then you can ask us in our comment section okay so that's all for today and we will meet in the next video so thank you thank you for watching and if you have not subscribed our channel then please subscribe it guys okay thank you